Hello YouTube, it's Saturday, and you know what that means. Ponies! So this morning premiered episode 2 of season 2 of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. It's part 2 to a two-part episode that began last week. So before I tell you about this week's episode, let's recap what happened 7 days ago. The evil villain Discord escaped, and the six main ponies have to use the Elements of Harmony to defeat Discord, except when they go to get the Elements of Harmony, they find out that Discord has stolen them and gave them a riddle of where to find it. They think that the riddle should lead them to the Labyrinth outside the castle, so they go into the Labyrinth hoping to find the Elements of Harmony. In the Labyrinth, they all get separated, and Discord takes each one of them and drains them of their particular element, whether it be loyalty, or humor, or generosity, it doesn't matter. He takes each one of them and drains them of the element that makes them special. Except for Twilight Sparkle, he leaves Twilight Sparkle alone. So at the end of the episode, they're all back together, and each one of them is grayed out and not themselves, except for Twilight Sparkles, who's wondering what's going on, but apparently apparently can't notice that everyone else is gray. The episode ends when Rainbow Dash flies away and Discord stands there laughing at them. And after this episode, I had a few predictions of what was to come. First of all, I theorized that because of Discord's riddle, the Elements of Harmony weren't going to be in the Labyrinth. Second of all, also off of Discord's riddle, I theorized that they would have to find the Elements of Harmony either back in the castle where they started, or they'd have to rediscover which element they are. That brings us to this week's episode. This episode starts off with Discord telling Twilight Sparkle that they were never going to find the Elements of Harmony in the Labyrinth, and that his riddle was misleading and Twilight misinterpreted it. Score one for Matthew! Then Twilight rethinks the riddle, decides that the Elements of Harmony must be back in Ponyville, and takes her and the five other ponies back to her library, where she opens up a book about the Elements of Harmony, where she thinks she's going to get an idea of where they might be, and the Elements of Harmony are sitting inside the hallowed out book. I did not see that coming. Score one for My Little Pony. Twilight gives each of her friends an element except for Rainbow Dash who flew away, so Spike takes the place of Rainbow Dash and they go and they try to defeat Discord. The elements start to power up, but because each pony is not truly the element they're supposed to be, they're not able to defeat Discord, and Discord continues ruining Ponyville. At this point, Twilight has lost all her friends, so she becomes gray because she is no longer herself. Luckily, Princess Trollestia got wind of what was happening and sent all the letters that Twilight has written to her in the past season back to her. Twilight reads through these letters, sees what friendship is made of and slowly becomes herself again when she realizes that friendship conquers all. She then hunts down the other ponies and uses her magic to remind each of them what element of harmony they are by making them remember times when they were all friends and worked together and everything was happy. Using this method, each pony was able to discover which element of harmony they are and become themselves again. Score 2 for Matthew. So equipped with the elements of harmony, the ponies back to their normal selves go and fight Discord, and this time, they win! <laughs> They're honored by Princess Celestia and they get their own little stained glass thing on the prophecy wall in the Great Hall because every story like this needs to have some sort of prophecy. Oh, and Discord turns back into stone, which gives me hope that he may be resurrected for a future episode, because I really like Discord. He's a cool villain. So, my feelings on this episode. I'm not a big fan of the two-parters. I feel they're much different from the rest of the series and don't have the same general mood to them. But I still like this episode. It had a good plot and though it was really predictable because I was able to predict two things that were to happen, it was still entertaining and still a really good show and still a really good episode and worth getting up early for. Unlike the last episode where I had some not important criticisms, I don't think I have anything against this current episode at all. There was nothing that stood out to me that I feel like I needed to make fun of or anything of the sort. It was just there and it was good. That's it. And thus wraps up episode 2 of season 2 of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Saturday mornings at 9 o'clock on The Hub. Thank you for watching. Tell me which pony is your favorite in the comments. Mine is Pinkie Pie. It's obvious she's on acid. And you should check out my cousin's channel, link to his channel in the doobly-doo, because I don't think he's watched My Little Pony yet, so you should make him comment that he should watch it over and over until he has no choice but to watch this show. But do it nicely, of course. And I will see you all... Uh, I'll probably see you tomorrow.